Rose Gold EP out right now, the pre pack. Like I said, shout out to Sakara, orderrun.com. You know it. Let's get it. The glass. All got a stash. It's hard not to brag. Everywhere that I go, they saying all got the bag. That work I've been dealing this. Hit the lick. Hey, what's up? It's your girl Safari, and you already know you are now tuned into On the Run. Of course, I have with me a very special guest. Are you guys ready? Rose Braun. Let's go. Hey, what's up? It's your girl Safari, and you already know you are now tuned into On the Run. Of course, I have with me a very special guest. Are you guys ready? Rose Braun. Let's go. Yo, yo, yo. What's good? How you doing today? Rocking, man. I got the album EP out. You know what I'm saying? The videos out. Shaking the sound out. Ready to go. Ready to rock. Yeah, so you know we gotta talk about that. First, yeah. congratulations, because I know that's exciting. Of course, appreciate that. Yeah, so why the title, Rose Gold? Rose Gold, well, the brand, right, which is the one we're right now, the Rose Gold, that's my, um, my merchandise, right, and it's lit, it's in every store, it's sold through the hood, it's like, it's bubbling right now, and of course my name is Rose, so it just makes perfect sense, like, to put it all together like that, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So, Everything is all about the roles, you know what I'm saying? I love that, for sure. And that's another thing. I love the fact that you're a business person. I was listening to your lyrics and I was like, this is what I'm talking about. So you know I got a quote. You got a quote for me? You know, you know it. So, hell yeah, we get a check. You also said, made bands with the stocks. And I'm like, this is the conversation that we need to have. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So I'll tell you a little bit about that. Um, Dodge point. Real good mm -hmm. to me, right? Um, on the low, I do invest in stock because I like money, right? I do yes. bands, I made bands for stock, so yeah, that was a real good time. Remember the pandemic, you gotta shake it up. You know, <laughs> the bank, you know what I'm saying? It's the bag, so mm -hmm. that's, what, that's what we did. We made some money with the bands, with the stocks. That's what's up. So that was a pandemic move for you. That wasn't. I mean, I always wanted to get into stock, and I had free mm -hmm. time, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm like, fuck it, like, I got you know, free time, right. let's get to it, let's just, let's just shake it up. So it exactly. worked out, it worked out, it worked out. So how are you? We get a check. Yes. So I'm like a friend, I did some stuff too during the pandemic. So it, it went well. Okay. I'm gonna let people know on the secret. I did Facebook. So I was like, everybody gonna be home. Like, anywhere. You know, the first one I did is Zoom. 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 Yes. Zoom. 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 Yeah, so I also want to get into get the bag, right? Gotcha. So when you get your next big, big bag, what are two things that you really want to do in ASAP? Now, first thing I want to do is go to the studio, right? So I like recording that platinum and that uh, IMI and, of course, Fight Club, you know what I'm yes. saying? But I do my own home, you know what I'm saying? I want to own my own space and just turn up. So definitely get the studio space. And then I want to open up the store, right? The Rose Gold store so we can come shop yeah. and have a vibe, you know? Mm -hmm. So that's my first thing. I love that. So when did you get into rap? It seems like you, you know, you're really about the business and your merchandise. So. I mean, that's a, that's a tricky question because I've been rapping for a long time, but like mm -hmm. seriously, like in notice, in Ray Ray Play, and like um, VH1 and stuff like that. Uh, I was like, for the last five years. Wow, that's years crazy. And you know, so yeah. Finally get to that point where, you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's gonna rise, it's gonna bubble. It's Exactly, and you know, we have to talk about the features. I mean, people may not know this, but Chris Brown, that's the artist oh, yeah, that that's everybody the would work with. Um, definitely got yes. a 16, but well, more than 16 out of him. Um, got that a couple of years ago from the studio, Platinum Studio, around New Year's song. Um, and he's rapping on it, that's like the great thing about it, right? He's not even saying, he's like rapping on my heart, so. They were real good, I'm gonna borrow online, like 100,000 streams, like, it's lit, it's lit, it's a bro. That's insane. Like, so wait, how did y'all know each other to even be in studio? A mutual friend, a mutual friend, plugged us up, mm -hmm. homie, came in from LA, it was like, yo, come to the studio, let's go vibe, and Chris Brown and his team was there, the beat song, some of the tracks, and we heard it, just went to go crazy, so we heard it, you know, I was a good look for the world. That's fine, and you know what? So I'm from Yonkers, so when I saw Jaden, I was like, That's hold on, awesome. let's. Let's bring that back. So I'll give you a funny story. I used to record in Yonkers for a while in D Block Studio. Oh, word? Yeah, okay. So, yeah. so if you're from Yonkers, you know. So yeah, I lived up the hill. That's gotcha. the crazy gotcha. part. Never gotcha. hand or something like that. Yeah. Never hand, yeah. That's what you're saying. Close, so, yeah. close. I was, um, so I was recording there for a while and mm -hmm. just, you know, done it out, working, working, working. And um, she loses the first artist that I actually worked out. I, I, I did a song with Orpheal Box. In the wow. Word. The last one was with his. Right. That's when the album come in, on the Rose Gold. So, mm -hmm. you know, so, you know, ready for that. Rose Gold joined the kids. And sounds easy, bro. You know what I mean? 
kids who joined this video for money dollars. That's fine. I did, I did my rounds. I did my rounds. <laughs> and a lot of people cannot relate to that. They have a record of all three. So Absolutely. to you, that's very rare. Yeah, yeah. And also, your beats are insane. Ziploc, the you fact that, that you, you sampled Lauren Hill, that's I was fine. like, let's go. Yeah, shout out to GQ Beats on that. That's my producer. In house, mm -hmm. we some GQ with my bro. So he, he sat and created that and it worked. Yeah, that's on his heart. But you know, flavor, you body that too. That shit. You body that's that. That's the joint of the pre pack. Go get the pre pack right now. Right it's now. out, it's screaming. <laughs> so you know, pre pack is fire. Flavor is one of my favorite joints right now. Some of everyone's favorites right now. It's a pregnant yeah. sample. I was, you know, coming over. So um, yeah, that's that shit. I love that. And you know, we gotta talk about lyrics. That's it. He said, we ain't flooding the peaks, we hit the road for it. And I love that. I think change is so necessary. And if people didn't realize that before, I think the pandemic opened some eyes. Absolutely. So, what I is your take? I don't need different things. Like I said, fashion, film, just do try something different, think out the box. You know what I'm saying? Socks, like, you know, do some of that. Right. And well, what is like an impact you really want to make in the project or so just environment wise? That you can do it from nothing, from nothing to something. And just believe in yourself. And Hard. You know, the labels won't come, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Uh, and is there any advice that you want to give to them or any advice that you personally received that helped you keep going? Um the best advice that I received is just believe in yourself. Uh, don't take no for an answer. Work hard and don't be afraid to reintroduce yourself until you don't have to anymore. Going blood and I listen to Nip. Ran it up, 90 in the Audi. Rain, hail, sleet, snow, even when it's cloudy. Flipping